Right now and happening today, downtown Indy's original farmer's market returns and it's back to its original spot after being moved for the past two years. Our Eric Pointer joins us now live from downtown where the market will open in just a few short hours. Eric, good morning to you. How are they hoping to be back? Uh, how are they hoping that being back in their normal spot is going to help things moving forward? Well, good morning to you as well. So they had to move due to construction and during the pandemic. So it kind of like uh, didn't help their attendance, right? So they're hoping that being back in their new location will help boost the attendance and boost the sales. And here to tell me more is the market manager, Mandy Wright Jarrett. So Mandy, kind of what's going to be new this year for people to see? Well, we're super excited. We're only going to be a few steps off of the front entrance of the Indianapolis City Market. So just having that cohesiveness of having us all back together again, the vendors outside, the merchants indoors, that is a huge deal for all of us just to be home again. <laughs> yeah, and so it is a huge deal, right, to be in the new spot. How do you hope it'll help with the market this year? Well, in... And historically in the past, you know, we were there for 23 years. The last two years were pretty rough. Um, so when you have folks who are familiar with a location, a historic location like this, we have lots of folks who remember just to come. Um, you know, we changed locations a lot um, last year and the year before, and I think that caused some confusion. So just that um, being at the same place where everyone's very familiar and feels nostalgic about is important. Okay, and we were kind of talking a little bit about the SNAP benefits and how that's helping the local farm. Kind of explain how the SNAP benefits work. Yeah, so something we're really proud about with the Indianapolis City Market is our element of food. So the farmer's market does serve that um, for accessibility. We, we focus on local urban farms, local farms within an hour of Indianapolis. So folks who are wanting to get produce within this location, they can um, with their SNAP benefits. So if they're trying to help with that grocery bill, we also have the Fresh Bucks program, and that's an additional $20 per market visit per day. So that's a huge influx of cash for folks to get healthy food from local farms. So it helps them and it stimulates our local farms and stimulates the local economy. Okay, and so is there anything else you want to add? Anything you want people to know as they're waking up this morning getting ready for the market? We just appreciate all the support. We've had a lot of people reach out and um, it's been a rough two years and we're just so excited to be home and we're ringing our historic bell at 10 o'clock. So please everyone come and join us. Um, it, everyone's just, we're just excited to to start fresh. <laughs> All right, awesome. Well, thank you very much. And again, that market opens at 10 o'clock this morning from 10 a.m. until 1.30 p.m. If you want additional details, we've got those posted for you on our website, cbs4indy.com. Live here downtown, Eric Pointer, CBS4 News.